I did it. It's all sheetrock. Da, da, da. Oh, it's an echoey room now. Cool. So, yeah, now I'm ready to build some shelves. <clears throat> um, I could wait on the shelves and just move all the stuff in here, I suppose. But I'm going to see if I can quickly engineer some shelves and uh, throw them up. Because I know that will increase the storage efficiency of this room by a lot. I'm not going to mud and tape um, because this garage isn't currently climate controlled. And if I don't, if I mud and tape it, it'll all crack because it'll ch it changes temperatures um, and that creates cracking and shifting and stuff. So, all right. Uh, yeah. Dude. So, after I got the sheetrock done, I built a shelf. So, uh, these shelves I've designed at 30 inches tall because I measured these plastic tubs over here and most of them are like 12 or 13 and figured I can stack two. So I found the tallest ones, which are these green ones here, um, and they will, they will fit stacked double high under 30 inches. So that's what I'm going to do, 30 inches apart. Um, so I can fit two double high. Uh, this right shelf is made out of a, it's actually a siding for a skyscraper. Uh, I got it off Craigslist, long story. But anyway, it's 32 inches deep, so it should fit the, those little bins well. I might even be able to put them sideways. Oh, that'd be cool. So basically what I did is I took some plywood, cut it into triangles, I mounted it on these studs here that are still exposed and then I took this piece of wood here and I drilled it sideways into the plywood from the other side and then I took self-tapping sheet metal screws and went up into there so it's all hooked in solid. So um, it's strong enough to hold me, he says as he jumps up. Uh, so my only real work concern with strength is this wall which is not very well supported but um, yeah so there's one level and I'm gonna go put up uh, one more check it out I have a storage room I have carpeted the floor because that seemed like a good idea um, this OSB chips and flakes and that's irritating I also have two sets of shelves, both super solid. Um, they're going to fit two, two, uh, two rows, I guess, of tubs in each level. I, I opted for not another shelf up here. I'm not talking very well. I opted for not. Um, I decided not to put a shelf up here because it would be difficult to get to and load. So this will be probably either two layers of tubs or awkward tall stuff. I left a space over here specifically to store tall things that need to be stored upright or you know that's like that, that, skis and poles and what other tall stuff do I have? A bunch of stuff like fishing rods and hockey sticks, shovels, you know all that stuff. Like you gotta have a place for tall stuff. Over here I'm gonna have plastic shelving units probably and just random storage. Same thing over here. And the furniture will most likely be in the middle. So I can walk around it and get stuff out. Yeah, yeah. Or the furniture will be against the wall. Um, and the middle will have shelving units. I haven't decided yet. Um, so I guess it really depends on the... Come on. It depends on the height of the shelving units. Uh, because if the shelving units are too high and they can't fit under the old ceiling then it's not gonna work so, anyway that's the uh, storage room project complete Thanks. so here we are uh, my, my hair is a mess but uh, the storage room is full of stuff so the shelves worked out pretty good uh, in some cases I can fit three and in some cases just two I also sized these perfectly for 
Uh, banana boxes. Banana boxes. Uh, it'll fit three banana boxes high. Um, which is awesome because banana boxes are the best thing you could possibly use for storage. <sighs> okay. Banana boxes are great because they're uh, free from grocery stores. Uh, they have handles built in. And they're two parts. You lift the top off, and then there's a bottom part. Um, and they're super sturdy. You could stand on them. So they're awesome. I use them for storage uh, sometimes. I use them for moving generally, but I'm hopefully done that. So yeah, um, it's full, and that's awesome. <laughs>